Welcome back to another video everyone. So in the last video I tried out the new nether update for the first time. I had to use a copy of my real world because apparently when you come out of the beta it won't let you play it again. And I just wanted to sort of see what the nether looks like in the new update. It wasn't really an actual playthrough but that's what I'm going to be doing today. I'm going to keep it all survival even though it is on another copy of my world. So if I do die it's not like it's really going to matter anyway. But still I'm going to keep it all survival. I'm going to go into the nether and try and find some of the other things that have been added because I didn't check everything out in that video. I know there's a few biomes that I missed. I missed the netherite completely. You guys also told me that there's like a new sort of nether fortress, like a new structure that you can go into and it has loot in it. So I'm excited about that. That's the thing that I want to find the most, I think. Even though I can't keep any of the loot that I find in it. I just like raiding things. We need to take building blocks because I learned my lesson in my last video. Wait, what's my armor looking like? Non-existent, okay. Since it's just a copy, let me just whip the iron out and use it on some fresh armor. Right, let's go into the nether. I also learned that you can ride those strider things in lava. They're basically like boats, but you need a saddle and I think you need something else too. Um, I'm not entirely sure what, so I guess we'll just have to continue building bridges over lava for now. But the question is, where do we go? All right, there's a blaze there. Let's uh, get off of here as quick as we can. I wish I brought my Elytra from home, like my actual home, not my mansion. That's the problem with the nether. Oh, it's not a problem with the nether, it's just like, you just have to build a lot of bridges to get to land. Oh, God. Those ghasts are scary, man, especially when you're on like a bridge like that. Um, where do we go? I'm not sure, but I'm gonna try and bridge my way across here. Oh, there's a strider just below me. Should have brought more building blocks. I need, wait, if I'm gonna have to keep doing this. Oh, shit, there he is. Good riddance. Okay, we have to watch out for multiple enemies now, because usually it's just nether pigs, and they don't attack you. Oh no, and blobs too. There seems to be an increase in blobs in this update too. I ran into so many in the last episode, and I never come across that many. But now we have to watch out for piglins, uh, the rhino things, I forgot their name already. Oh. Oh, shit. Oh, God. Easy. I haven't ran into any of those piglins yet. Oh, shit. Oh, what's that? Gold? Hold up a sec. I'm being... Right, let's get through here before we check what that is. Okay, I think that's good enough. Gold nugget. Is that new? Is that a new addition? I don't think I've ever seen that in the nether before. Right, is this going to take me out anywhere? Or am I just going to be digging forever? Oh, no, we're out. Oh, hold on a sec. I think we might have just found the new nether fortress. I mean, this definitely isn't a nether fortress. Ooh, fancy. Look at this. Holy shit. So I was right then, because in my last video I said, I wonder if there's like a structure for these like new piglin things. I compared them to pillagers, because you know, they walk around, they have crossbows. What's this? Oh no, but I can't wait until this update comes to the game. It's probably going to be months, but I actually love all the new additions that they've made to the nether. They've made it more interesting. Right, we've got to be careful here, because it's just a bunch of holes, and I don't want to accidentally drop to the bottom, especially when there's lava there. What is this thing actually called, though? Well, what's the official name of it? These guys are fucking idiots. He's got a crossbow, we've got to watch out for him, though. He could push us off. Never mind, he just fell off, too. Triple kill. Oh, we've got some gold blocks down there. Oh, and there's a chest and one of them just fell off. There's a chest down there as well. Let's go see what the loot is. None of them are going to drop down and land on here, are they? Right, here's what I'll do. Oh yeah, I did read in the comments that if you're wearing any gold, like just even a gold helmet, I think is enough. They won't kill you. They won't be attracted to you. So, and you can even trade with them, I think, if you do that. So that's interesting. We could have avoided all of this murder if we just wore a bit of gold. Anyway, we're at the bottom now. Let's go see what this place has. Ah, crossbow guy there. That could be dangerous. Ooh, okay, let's put that on quick. Then we won't have to deal with these guys. Ancient debris and some gold blocks. Netherite leggings, holy shit. Is it worth putting on? Actually, I'm not gonna put that on because it's about broken. And we got some netherite boots too. I'm gonna put them on because they're actually half full. I want to try and trade with the, the pigling things. Let's make a bunch of gold from this. Looks like these places are gonna be rich in gold then. Yeah, they're friendly now. Right, do you want some gold? 
I thought you could, I thought you could trade with them. Oh, so you can give them gold then. What are you going to do, just look at it? You want to give me something for, for that or what? Oh. Okay, so me and these guys are buddies now then. Oh shit, they give you different things. Nether brick block. Give me some netherite. What's that? Gravel, take it back me. More obsidian. Ooh. Crying obsidian. What can you do? Well, what's the difference between crying obsidian and real obsidian? Oh, he just gave me a bit more as well. Okay, so that's pretty cool then that you can trade with those guys. Let's get out of here then, because I think that's... I don't think this place offers much else. I mean, you can pretty much see through the whole thing. But the loot is nice. The loot is nice. I'm a fan of these places. Uh, I'm going to keep going that way, so this is terrifying. I'm hoping there's no guests around. Doesn't look like you. Oh, blue flames. Yes, this is what I was... Wait, hold on. Oh, that's... Yeah, just a random skeleton. I just walked past him. This is what I was talking about in my previous video. I saw this in the menu, you know, the new title screen of the beta. There's a bunch of skeletons over there. Maybe it's the home of skeletons. There's these little post things as well. Still haven't found any nether, right? Or is that this? No, I don't think it is. Holy shit. Look how many skeletons there are. Oh, and there's more too. Yeah, this is like, this got to be a biome for skeletons or something. Okay, I kind of wanted to stay in that biome, but I want to get the fuck out of here at the same time. Hold up, what? Are you really following me into here? I think the only thing left for me to find is the netherite. This update is so much easier when you've got some gold armor on. Ooh, what's that? We've found something. Yeah, this is a different biome. This isn't the blue flame biome. Interesting. Um, I guess we're moving out of this one then and straight into one of these. Ooh, got some of these to deal with. Get the fuck out of here. Give me your meat. Never gonna say that again. What can you find in these biomes though? Like surely they've got to be used for something. What can you make with these resources that you find here? Also, I haven't came across another one of those uh, castle things. So they must be rarer than nether fortresses because you can find them relatively quickly. There's a chest over there. Oh, random chest. That's always a good sign. Do that again. Watch what happens. Ha! That's what I thought, pussy. Oh, back for more. Oh, that's it. I've had enough of you. I've had enough of you. I've had enough of you. Yeah, you better run off. Yeah, you better run off because I'm coming at you. I'm coming. I'm coming to slice you in half. Let's loot this place. Obsidian. A golden pickaxe. Silk touch one. Okay, okay. Golden carrot. I don't think I've ever... That must be new. Actually, no, I don't think it is new. I've heard of it before, but I've never seen it before though. So it must be a new thing. Who just shot me? Warped planks. Let's make some warped planks. And then I think we can make a crap. Yes, we can. What can we make with what we've got? Anything? Netherite scrap. Can we not make that? I'm genuinely interested in where you can find this netherite because it's not like you can go mining and digging, is it? You're just going to fall into lava. So where do you find it? Yeah, I think I might end this video here, guys, and carry it on in the next video. At least I found a new structure in this video and raided it. Traded with some piglins and found a couple more biomes, even though I don't know what to do in them or what to find. Are we going to... Uh, come on, let's not die. We're at the end of the fucking episode, and I want to carry on from where I left off. Oh, fuck. We cannot get that close to death. I think the only thing left for me to find is that netherite, so that's what I'm going to do in the next video. Obviously, I am going to continue the Woodland Mansion uh, series or whatever you want to call it once I've explored this new beta update. But yeah, let me know where I can find some netherite or what I can make nether scrap with. I think there's a nether fortress over there. I'll read your comments and then I'll go and try and do it in the next episode. In the next video, I'm also going to try and ride on one of those striders. I think it'd be pretty cool to be able to walk in lava. But yeah, thank you for watching. I hope you all enjoyed. Definitely subscribe if you're new here and I'll see you all in my next video.